Welcome to Forensics Detectors. I'm Dr. Koji Gas Media Gas Detector. And check it out, folks. We are talking phosphine gas detection. P H3. That's phosphine gas. This little beauty detects phosphine gas from 0 to 20 parts per million with a 0.1 ppm resolution. Very fine fidelity to get those little phosphine gas molecules. Check it out, folks. Backlight. We're talking gas sensors. So the phosphine molecules are detected at the front. Side view, ABS housing. At the back, stainless steel bow clip. On the other side profile, we see a USB recharge port. Very, very robust unit indeed a workhorse when detecting phosphine it comes in a package just like so within it you have your usb recharge cable you have your sling for wrist holding you have your color manual and you get your nist calibration certificate to assure you that we have calibrated it here in los angeles to nist traceable sources that's the only way you can assure that it is accurate folks now dr guys how does it work Okay, I will show you how it works. We have phosphine gas, we have a gas regulator, and we have a tube to the calibration cap. Now this calibration cap basically pops on to the front to deliver the gas onto the sensor. Just like so folks, you see that. Now make sure you don't detect, regularly detect it like this, okay? This cap is only made when you're calibrating or you are forcing air to the sensor. Now we're gonna expose it to some phosphine gas. We're in a well ventilated space over here. You're gonna see the numbers slowly going up. You're gonna see them climbing and climbing as it's detecting the phosphine gas molecules okay folks that's the way it's working as you could see the numbers are going up and now you could see the numbers are going down okay that's the way it works quite nice indeed folks and very very sensitive look i hope that all makes sense till then be well be safe and see you soon